everybody, it's Polish Pete, and I'm here at Omnia's headquarters in Golden Valley, Minnesota, and just landed here. Today is some additions from Yamamoto. We've got the Vertical Lures 2X and some drop shot baits from Robo Worm and Reigns. So, Yamamoto Flappin' Hog, we added both sizes in the Flappin' Hog. We have that smaller version here. I think this is a three and a half or three and three quarter. And the four inch version in the Flappin' Hog, these have been a staple in tournament anglers boats for a very long time. In fact, so much so, I was very surprised we did not have them. I actually saw a customer comment, so thank you very much, uh, that we did not have these and we got them scooped up right away. So good catch on that one. These have been a big fish getter for a long time. I just recently watched Brent Ayler catch a big kicker fish on one of these. Uh, creature bait version of, of a Yamamoto bait. So these are heavily salted. They have that Yamamoto feel to them. Uh, so you can actually fish these weightless if you do want or fish smaller weights on them than a traditional plastic. Uh, that fish do tend to hang on to the Yamamoto style plastics quite a bit longer. So uh, if you're looking to upgrade your flipping game and you've never tried a flapping hog or if it's an old staple for you, we've got them now. So Yamamoto flapping hogs are in. Next up is a funny one for me. Uh, some of my buddies uh, out here in Minnesota will laugh when they see me talking about this one because back in the day, a long time ago, a guy got uh, these to me, the Vertical Lures Tube X. And this was my confidence bait as a really newbie uh, bass angler back in the day. Uh, I would flip this thing absolutely everywhere and this thing is a bite getter. It catches, my favorite thing about this tube is it's a flipping tube, but it catches smallmouth as well too. This is actually a, a, a tube that to me is the best flipping bait I've ever, I've ever fished for fishing both smallmouth and largemouth. So you river anglers that are out there that are fishing smallmouth in similar waters, even up on our famed waters of Mille Lacs, if you're fishing, fishing the reeds and things like that, this bait is an absolute bite getter. Uh, it's pretty unique flipping bait. So if you wanna try the tube X to, get, to try something different to throw the fish, give this one a whirl. Uh, Next up is two drop shot baits, one from Robo Worm here. This is the Alive Shad. So it's a hand poured shad shaped uh, drop shot bait that it looks obviously minnow profile here. Uh, Robo Worm's probably the most famous of all the hand poured kind of styled uh, finesse baits out there. So if you're a Robo Worm person, you already know they're bite getting uh, plastics. Uh, if you're new to the drop shot game, this is a phenomenal brand to start trying out all their baits. Uh, I'll bet you build a lot of confidence in them quickly. And the ne next one here is from Reigns. Reigns is a Japanese company that's gotten a lot of attention uh, in the last few years. They got a bunch of killer baits. This is also a shad profile worm, but it's got a ribbed body to it, which is a confidence thing for me. I love the way ribbed bodies uh, uh, you know, move water around and they, they undulate in the water column very, very well. Um, these got a little pintail to them, so this is going to get a lot of subtle action out of a very little movement. So if you're Fishing a body of water where it's tough to get a bite or you're trying to find a, uh, fill out a limit, uh, these are two different baits here that you might want to check out for to up, up, up your drop shot game. So uh, check out all these plastics right now. They're available on the site and go catch them.